Today we're going to travel from Monterrey to Romania to know about their history and their economy. Enjoy! Romania is located in the intersection of Central and Southeastern Europe near the Black Sea. Romania shares a border with Hungary, Serbia, Ukraine, Bulgaria and Moldova. At 238,400 square kilometers, Romania is the ninth largest country in the European Union by area and has the seventh largest population of the European Union with over 19 million people. Its capital and largest city is Bucharest, the tenth largest city in the European Union with a population of around 2 million. In May of 1877, Romania gained independence from the Ottoman Empire and was internationally recognized as a country to the following years. In August 1950, when World War I broke out, Romania declared neutrality. Two years later, under pressure from borders, Romania joined the Allies, declared war in Austria and Hungary. World War I, Transylvania, Bukovina, and Bessarabia united with the Kingdom of Romania. Greater Romania emerged into an era of progression and prosperity that would continue until the eve of World War II. That war caused the rise of military dictatorship in Romania, leading it to fight on the side of the Axis power from 1941 to 1944. It then switched sides in 1944 and joined the Allies. By the end of war, many northeastern areas of Romania's territories were occupied by the Soviet Union. And Romania forcibly became a socialist republic and a member of Warsaw Pact. With the fall of the Iron Curtain and the 1989 revolution, Romania began its transition towards democracy and a capitalism market economy after a de decade of post revolution economic pro problems and living standards declined. Extensive reforms foster economic recovery as of 2010 Romania is an upper middle income country with high human development Romania joined NATO on March 29 2004 the European Union on January 1 2007 with a GDP of around 267 billion and a GDP per capita of 12,400 76,000 for the year 2011, Romania is an upper middle income country and has been part of the European Union since January 1, 2007. After a revolution, the National Salvation Front, led by Ion Liascu, took partial multi party democratic and free market measures. Several major political parties and pre war era were resurrected. After major political rallies in April 1990, a city in protest contesting the results of the recently held parliamentary elections began at University Square in Bucharest, accusing the NSF of being made up for former communists and members of the Security. The protesters called the election undemocratic and asked for the exclusion for political life of former high ranking Communist Party members, such as Lee School himself. The protest ra rapidly grew to become what President Lee School called a golem. The peaceful demonstrations turned into violence, prompting the intervention of coal miners summoned by Lee School on June 1990 from the Jiu Valley. This episode has been documented widely by both local and foreign media and is remembered as June 1990 minorist. After a communist regime was overthrown in late 1989, the country experienced a decade of economic instability and decline, led in part by an obsolete industrial base and a lack of structural reform. From 2000 onwards, however, the Romanian economy was transformed into one of the related macroeconomic macro stability, proving that Romania made the right decision in joining the European Union, Pro like to taking in account that it helped their economy and their economical growth. Characterized by high growth, low unemployment, and declining inflation, in 2006, according to the Romanian Statistics Office, the GDP grows in real terms and was recorded at 7.7, .7, one of the highest rates in Europe. It is estimated by the IMF that the GDP will grow again 4.4% in the 2012.
The subsequent disintegration of the front produced several political parties, including the Social Democratic Party, the Democratic Party, and the Alliance from Romania, the former government Romania from 1990 until 1996 chose several coalitions and governments with Lon Liscu as head of state. Since then, there have been several democratic changes of government. In 1996, the Democratic Liberal Opposition and its leader, Emil Constantinescu, acceded to power. In 2000, the Social Democrats returned to power, with Liescu once again president, and in 2004, Trajan Baescu was elected president with an electoral coalition called Justice and Truth Alliance. Baescu was narrowly re elected in 2009. Post Cold War Romania developed closer ties with Warren Europe every 12 joining NATO in 2004 and hosting the 2008 summit in Bucharest, the country completed in June 1993 from membership in the European Union can become an associated state of the UN, European Union in 1995, an according country in 2004, and a member on January 1, 2007, following the three travel agreement of the political of the post-Cold War period, as well as hardship of the life into, in the ni 1990s economic depression. Romania has the incredibly large diaspora estimate at over 2 million people that main emigration tars are sp Spain, Italy, Germany, Australia, and United Kingdom, Canada, and the United States. During the 2000s, Romania enjoyed one of the highest economic growth rates in the Europe and has been referred to as the Tire of Eastern Europe. This has been accompanied by a significant improvement in human development. The country has been successful in reducing internal poverty and establishing a functional democracy. However, Romania's development suffered a minor setback during the late 2000s. Recession as a larger gross domestic product containing a large budget deficit in 2009. That led to Romania borrowing heavily, eventually becoming the largest debtor in the International Monetary Fund, fund in 2010. Worsening economic conditions led to popular unrest and eventually to a political crisis in 2012. Romania still faces issues related to infrastructure, medical services, education and corruption.